guys can you hear i don't know what the problem is he will come rushing back <laughs> it's okay calm down calm down do you want to not be on my team? Please go and take the food I gave you. When you come, this is what I go through every day, guys. A day in the life. The first time he saw himself in the mirror, he was scared. <laughs> and I think I've gotten used to it. Real come. Hey. There's nothing there for you. Come. This. Hey. He's such an idiot. Is the hair, oh, the hair poking out of the thing? Such an idiot. Hey. hey. Oh God. Okay, guys. Hi, guys. Welcome back to my channel. So I'm going to pretend like I'm I'm dead or I've collapsed. <laughs> he wants to come in the camera. It's okay. Don't kiss me. And then I'll see how my dog behaves. Okay. Rony, this dog left me to die. Rony, <laughs> my God, <sighs> hey, 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 they left me to die on the floor. Hey, hey, <laughs> he says, Fuck you. Hey, I was lying right here, dead. <laughs> you are such a bad dog, do you know that? Unsuccessful video, guys. Unsuccessful video. <laughs> Literally, as you can see, I, I don't have a, a dog who cares. I'm done with this hair, as I told you guys. I don't know how to keep weave, so we're going to the salon to take it down. Also... I just did retouch, otherwise my hair will become red. So I need to go do washing. And yeah, I'll use it for wake up. So I'm just going to take it down and that will be it. Okay guys, so my hairdresser, she's the one who does all my braids, every hairstyle you've seen me wear. She's the one who do it. All I have to do is show her the inspiration and we are good to go. So she's giving discounts of when you come to braid your hair. If you go and you tell her, oh, Cheryl sent me, you're going to get a discount from 10% upwards. Okay, so you have to book through me to get an appointment with her. Right. hey guys welcome back to my channel anyways don't mind my dog if you have any training on the dog <laughs> let me know because that girl anyways anyways guys you're welcome back to another video you're welcome back to my channel don't worry it's windy outside there's no ghost no ghost but yes if you are new to this channel you do lifestyle content food everything relatable okay you find it on this content so you could check out my other videos and you leave a comment i love 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 seeing you guys comments it makes my entire day so please do leave a comment under this video any other video that you watch after this if you are an og what's up gang i think i think you people should be writing the whatsapp gang in the in the comments okay if you're an og what's up gang in the comments but anyways click the subscribe button if you haven't and let's get right into today's video so today's video is 
going to be a deep one because I asked on Instagram that it's been a while I did a Q&A so you guys can ask me questions because and it should be juicy and some of you just went deep you just went straight into the water but anyways I don't mind and I love doing serious videos even though I'm not serious <laughs> but yeah 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 so I wrote down the questions um, I asked the people I wanted to ask them if they are cool with me putting down their names but maybe not everybody wants that so it's fine I'll just I wrote down the questions I'll not put down the name I'll just write the questions in the video I want to I want to start off easy but all the questions are deep ones so let's just start from anywhere so let me see number one question <laughs> This is so touching this is so lovely and it's so pure for somebody to ask you that and i'm very grateful for that so one prayer that i want god to do for me that i want you to help me to petition him hmm, is i want financial doors to be open to me because i have big plans I have big plans so i want financial doors to be opened it's opening but i want it more open okay but in his time in his will but that is one prayer that i i really want i want to be able to take care of my parents without sweating you know my parents actually are people that whatever amount they give them they appreciate it so much so i'm not worried about the amount that i give them but i want to be able to not sit and calculate so if I send this, if I send that, mm, I'll be left with this. I want to be able to just dip my hand in my savings and click send and my parents have money. So that's the kind of financial freedom I want to get to. And yeah, so that's the answer to that question. So thank you very much if you petition God on my behalf. So question number two will be... <laughs> First of all, I'm not dreaming of a man. But let's let's answer the question. <laughs> My dream man will be first of all somebody who is mature, somebody who understands commitments. Um if you are mature, I don't mind your age. You could be like 40, you could be 27, you could be 25, you could be younger than me, haha, because I'm 28, almost 29. So once you are mature, I like it. I love you. I love you. Mm? Yeah and um he should be rich he should be earning five to six figures right here in ghana even if he's outside the country or whatever he should be earning five to six figures um he should be tall he should be handsome freaking handsome because i want my children to be looking cute i don't want someone to come and tell my child you have inner beauty it's i love you for your personality no hey mm. <laughs> I want my child to possess everything a physical appearance check personality check you, you get it you get the point so yeah he should be rich he should be handsome he should be tall um he should have a career okay and he should not be self-employed um he, he can have a business on the site but he should have a stable paying job i say that because i want a guy who can exercise because i'm an hr i want somebody who can exercise their leave somebody who can take time off to rest you know because i don't want someone to come and die on me after 20 years of marriage when we are struggling to make money and then after 20 years when the money has come and we are supposed to relax and you die because you are stressed i don't want that i don't want that so i want somebody who earns five to six figures as a career and has something on the side which is fine because i have lots of things on the side so it's fine um i think it's the same thing as was my dream man but some what traits okay so this specifically is traits um i want somebody who communicates this is kind of crazy when i say it in my ears because i tried to communicate and it wasn't taking well so i thought i was a problem but i think i really want somebody who can communicate and i recently met somebody who knows how to communicate like he speaks the truth he tells you what it is and he's not afraid of me or nothing so you just tell me hey this thing you're doing is wrong and i'll take it you know but um 
yeah somebody who knows how to communicate um communicate maturely communicate in every circumstance whether good news bad news um advice you know somebody who truly knows how to communicate is what i'm looking for first of all secondly i want somebody the traits that i'm critically going to look at is um just how the person treats me just how he treats me because people can love bomb you in the beginning they will love bomb the shit out of you and then at the end of the day you realize that it was just love bombing so i just watch closely to how the person treats me because i'm going to be matching energy on this side i'm not going to be you know the soft cheryl and no we are not doing that anymore now when people call me for advice this is advice i give them we are matching energy first of all you're supposed to be my leader if we get married you're supposed to be the head of the home your supervisor is jesus christ because you're supposed to act like him i'm supposed to be like the church you are supposed to head the church so if you are going on the tangent that oh when i'm angry i give my wife silent treatment when i'm angry i give my girlfriend silent treatment baby boy is the silent treatment i'll give you mm, you talk to me i talk to you if you don't talk to me i don't talk to you yeah nobody's come and tell me oh you shouldn't do that two wrongs don't make it right let him be the right one why not so psa if you're coming into my life again this time you're coming into my life <laughs> please note i will mirror exactly what you do to me exactly what you do to me so let's be guided because i'm a very nice person i love you so much whoever you are but if you try to play tricky try to play games <laughs> i'll play the same game is so great a question i think i have a whole video on salary information um that i wanted to do specifically like an hr video so i don't know how i'm going to answer this question but let me just give you the surface whenever i get to film that video you get to know because first of all bear in mind that salaries are not construed with your personal needs in mind just just get out out of the way um, so you have to appreciate if you're in a company that does salary increase. So you have to appreciate them. Um, anyway, so um, how do I budget my salary? Hmm. Because I'm not going to say exactly how much I earn, obviously. But I do the... I just put down all my expenses that I know that maybe March. So let's say we're in February. So maybe March. I put down all my expenses. I owe 90 CDs. I, I'll do my hair for... I budget how much I want to do for my hair. So like maybe 150 or 200 CDs. And because maybe I have a wig I want to go and use. I think about all those things. I put down my hair. So there are some constant things on my on my expenditure every month. That is light, um, water, and my hair, my nails, um, transportation for the month. So we are in February. I would budget for... The whole of march and my transportation to work the whole month is around a thousand eight hundred or thousand six hundred the whole month so i budget that that's my first thing i even budget because i have to go to work the next month so that's the other thing i budget and then money for my parents is a sick thing i budget for and i just put miscellaneous can be 200 cities just because i want to buy a dress or i want to eat out i want to go on a date i want to you know eat a bougie I just put miscellaneous for that and then savings are the second things actually after i take out my transportation savings goes next i have two savings accounts um i have one savings account at zenith i have another savings account at stambic so i save concurrently um come to talk of insurance or investments i don't have investment investment like data bank investment those things i do not have but what i have are life policies so I have a life policy for my mom, my dad, myself. I used to have for my husband, uh, which is still running. So I need to check that. So um, I used to have life policies for all of us. And then I have a different life policy for just myself. In case anything happens to me and all that, I, I have that life policy. I have health insurance for my mother and myself. Because my mom is, like I told you that, she is the one who is not well. My dad is a strong guy. So even though he needs help but yeah, i push all my money to my mom so i have health policies or health insurance for my mom not national health insurance so i have that for my mom as well so that's that 
so let's move on how much do you earn on youtube i think that would be a whole different video because i'm at 12 minutes right now so that would be a whole different video guys so i'll answer to you okay thank you and the last question then will be are you seeing anyone at the moment <laughs> Nonsense. I am not seeing anyone at the moment. I'm not. Nobody interests me. Everybody's a liar. All those who have come around, they are just liars. Plain liars. And so, no, I'm not seeing anyone at the moment. So, but I'm cool. I'm fine. I'm cool. Mm -hmm. Like, I've learned so much. I think I should be on another video. But yeah, basically, I've learned so much um about myself i've learned to love on myself um so this is actually a really great experience for me and yeah so thank you guys for your questions and i hope i answered it right let me know in the comments if you have any more questions you can visit me on instagram and leave the rest of your questions i love doing q and a's because sometimes you don't know what to film and people want to know something but they cannot ask unless you give them the opportunity so i'm glad i did this and your questions are so great and yeah thank you guys and i'll see you guys in another video bye and oh happy valentine's day happy i should be in a relationship by i should be in a relationship by quarter quarter wednesday or even tuesday evening so that wednesday i can get a valentine gift what do you think maybe maybe so yeah <laughs> bye guys <laughs>